Hi everyone, welcome to the video and in this video we are going to see how you can set up Bruno on your Windows machine. In Windows we have different options uh, through the package manager, through the terminal you can download Bruno. You can simply use portable or the exe file to set up Bruno on your Windows machine. So first thing you have to do is to go to website. This is the official Bruno website that www.usebruno.com. You can see the nice interface and then you can go to download section. In the download section, we have three different options, Windows, Mac, Linux. You have to choose Windows and according to your use case, if you want to use Portable, you can use Portable. If you want to use EXE, you can use EXE. I will choose EXE file, which I already downloaded. So you can click on this download button. It will automatically download that EXE file to your system and you can start installing that. So I already have the .exe file. Let's navigate to the download file and let's open this. Excel. You have to double click on that to start installation. Once it will start the installation, it will do all the checks for your system and it will automatically launch the Bruno app for you. So you will see the Bruno app running on your machine like this. And yeah, the Bruno app is available now. So you can start playing with it, importing your collection, create a new collection. Open API spec, postman collection, anything. I have this basic collection called basic. So you can just simply go here and run the APIs. You can use, use body parameters, auth. And this is the latest uh, major release that we launched Bruno version 2.0.1. So this is a major release that we recently launched. So you can go and check out the latest update or the changelog. So if you go to change log, so you can see what are the new updates, what are the fixes that we did, what are the improvements on the CLI, everything you will found here. So you can go to website, you can download the windows, .exe file or the portable and you can also go for the change log to see what are the changes which we make to stay up to date. And as I mentioned, we also support the different package managers that windows supports just like a choco winjet scoop uh, you have to set up the choco you can refer all the windows documentation I have the windows and choco as well but i will prefer to go with winjet because i have the winjet setup so just copy this command if few people prefer to go with package managers instead of uh, downloading the .exe file so some people prefer that way. So I just want to show you how you can do that. So simply we copy the winget command to install Bruno from the website and you have to just copy paste on your terminal and you have to press enter. Some people prefer the terminal way to install Bruno. So that's why I want to guide you through as well how you can set up the Bruno through the packet manager that Windows support instead of downloading exe file and use a portable version. But I mostly prefer .exe files. It simply just download a particular file, click on it, and yeah app is ready for you so this is the terminal way you can do winjet install bruno bruno and yeah the app will be available uh, in few seconds it's also depends on your internet connection uh, if you have a good strong internet connection it will quickly do like it's showing on the screen so bruno is installed it will open the app shortly and then you can start running your collection in request on that so we have to wait for a few seconds so, so Bruno is installed now and yeah, the app is running on your Windows system. It will open the nice interface just like this. And yeah, I have a basic collection as I mentioned when I download the .exe file, you, you saw the same collection. And this is my basic collection again. And we install this Bruno app through the Winjet, uh, not from the .exe file. So this is a two different ways you can do that uh, you can use also the portable uh, some people prefer dot portable uh, portable files basically portable it just gives the folder and you have to run the Bruno .x file you don't need to install a lot of stuff it will just simply run file for you so you can run x if uh, you can run your request and also as we mentioned that uh, the major release version 2 we have the breaking changes and how the over two improvements so it's a lot of uh, 
improvements that we implemented in latest version so you can go and check out and yeah this is the download section you have to go you have to choose windows and for the terminal base you can do this so this is a guide you can follow to set up bruno on your windows machine thanks for tuning in see you in the next video